in part the reason that, that I'm encouraged that Sister Giant and the recovery movement and the spiritual community wants to get involved in politics is because I saw it for many, many years, uh, several decades from the other side. I got deeply involved with, with uh, helping to start and run a halfway house for homeless alcoholics and addicts, uh, many of them homeless, many of them coming out of prison. Uh, and, and it wasn't just a light involvement. I mean, it's something I spent at least 10, 12, 15 hours a week at and, and several years stopped my regular job and went down there and lived and ran. Um, and, and, and many good things came out of that. I, obviously, many good things came for me. It was uh, critical to my spiritual growth and my understanding of the world. Uh, but I also did see that, that that by turning our back on politics that way and just hands-on running our local community ourselves with as little government involvement as possible was ineffective. Uh, the guys that we were serving, particularly the guys that were deeply damaged, that came coming out of prison multiple times and, and been homeless a long time, they needed more kind of government support than was available and that we could provide. So, so I, I think, I think it, it's wonderful that the spiritual community is involved in, in personal spiritual gro growth, but I think we see that we have an obligation to, to serve our broader community uh, and, and, and bring to it the wisdom we, we learn through, through our personal recoveries.